Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, we'll cover the Atomic Shop, what is new, and uh, what are the daily challenges, what do we have to do. And I really hope they're not going to be disappointing because for the past couple of days, they were just total, really, really, really trash, sad, bad, you name it. <laughs> but anyway, let's start wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so let's navigate to the Atomic Shop and see what we got today. Today we have a pose. Looking to the future, which I already claimed. And if you haven't had the time, the chance to claim it, you're able to claim it. Uh, so yeah, the pose is actually pretty cool. I remember they were selling this one, if I'm not mistaken, really, really long time ago. But then it came free. Anyway. So that is it for the Atomic Shop. Uh, I would highly recommend to list through all these sections as well because there are uh, items that are leaving the Atomic Shop, such as the Raider Skinner outfit, as you can see, and my uh, the Prime uh, Power Armor set is leaving. War Rider is pretty much leaving. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure. You see, I can't tell you exactly which is leaving because I don't have it. Uh, don't have the deadlines over here so we can see the other sections are leaving as well down here uh, the communist button is leaving and why is all this happening is because um, it's Monday tomorrow is Tuesday so we should be getting some changes I hope some new stuff <laughs> I might actually gonna go with these bun with these two bundles not sure I'm, I'm gonna give it a final thought I mean they're not that, that super epic I don't know I don't like it anyway so that is it I would recommend to also run through this section right here because there are some outfits that are not listed in the feature list you might miss out on them like for example if you go to the skins you will see that the shadow prime power armor is not listed in feature but is also leaving so I would recommend you to kind of like grind through uh, scroll through the entire item shop today give it a, give it a thing and see what's what's up what you want what you don't anyway so let's get with the challenges build floors walls roofs decor okay cool workshop very easy I do that by capturing a workshop spamming my uh, fork and done destroy robots in Batoga get 20 atoms super easy thank you wow you can you can now see that these challenges are good because you can make some real good atoms I mean this is like already 50 atoms off the bat, 60, 60 super easy atoms and if you do this one as well it's going to be 70. This is what I like Bethesda, this is what you got to give us every day. <laughs> Alright so kill robots in Batoga, for those who do not know Batoga is right over here. You go there and kill robots, done. Then also uh, kill a legendary enemy if you're lucky enough to find one. Uh, it's well you're gonna play for a long time you'll definitely run into a legendary enemy I've been running into a lot of legendary enemies lately uh, that is also super easy so then you have uh, level up and if you complete any of the following sub challenges three at the same time or three per or one per level whichever comes I would recommend doing uh, one three at the same time so basically what you gotta do is level up while engaged in PvP, disease, dealing an axe, will tune well rested, nuke region, caves mines, wearing full clown suit or sleepwear, a workshop under level 20, level 76 or higher. So any of these, you get additional 10 atoms. Revive 9 players in nuclear winter, okay this is a little bit challenging. And you gotta ask your guys to, hey man, can you jump off the cliff 9 times? <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's not that easy to revive. I mean, it won't. It, it's it's doable, but it's not that easy. Because by the time you try to revive, you get shot. Anyway, uh, scrap junk to produce screws. I'm gonna try to do this one right here, and uh, I go there to pick up typing machines, desk fans, and so on and so forth. And also, I'm definitely gonna run into a legendary. I don't remember the last time I made one uh, run in White Springs and didn't end up finding at least one legendary. So, I believe that is it for the daily challenges, all the weeklies are complete, so tomorrow we should be getting some new stuff in terms of weeklies, and I really hope the Atomic Shop is going to be nice. And that's pretty much it. So, as you planned, and everybody else, hope you enjoyed the show, and if you did, you know the drill. 
Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody sees them, I see them, I read them, and I delete them. Have that in mind. I can't react to comments that contain that bombs. There's enough for me to react, I need to approve them. And I don't do that. <laughs> so if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So I have from Ukraine if you want to play with us or share your content or share your screenshots, whatever. Uh, feel free to join our Discord. We have an active community. And basically, if you also need help, if you're a new player, we'll be able to hook you up with some stuff. So, this is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. You all have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys lucky at, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the clan, we have a gamer soul. By the might of the sword, we put the pen to the test. We are the clan, we are the gamers best. Oh, <laughs>